Hello everyone, welcome to Nitta Cloud Tech. In this video, we are going to discuss about how we can create a stack bar chart using Python in Power BI. So I'm going to create this graph. So in this graph, basically, if you see, uh, there are uh, different regions. So there's South, East, Center. And region wise, I'm showing sales, profit, discount, and quantity. So I have written this code to achieve the same. So don't worry guys, I'm going to write step by step this code and we'll explain it. Okay, so let's start. For writing Python code, first I will take p by. Okay, and uh, after that, I need to select the columns. So I am looking for region and sales, profit, discount, and then quantity. Okay, so whatever I will write here in my Python code, so I need to drag all the required columns here. Then only I will be able to write the code, otherwise it will give the error. So I need to use all these columns, so I have dragged and dropped here. Now let's start writing Python code. So let me import the library first, import mat dot edge mb import matplot lib dot py plot as pl okay now let's take this mb so from mb what i'm looking for there is one properties rc params Basically, what it will do, it will set the font size. So I need to write font dot size, and now I can give the size. Let's be done. Okay. Now let me take one variable for region. So what I'm looking, I'm looking region name. So for that, what I will write data set. So this is my data set basically and data set dot location and I'm looking this value from 0 to 6. Uh, it will start from 0 and 0 to 5, 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Okay. And I'm looking here region. Okay. Since uh, I have multiple regions so it will come into the list so i can use list function to list okay so this is my code to fetch all the regions okay now similarly i will use code to fetch the sales sales so data set dot dot that's fine here i will change it to sales okay now let's create the graph so plot dot i'm creating first bar chart then after that i will show you how to create a stack bar chart plot dot bar and this is my region and after that i have this sales and i can use color equals to let's say red Okay, now I will write plot dot show to execute this. Now let me run this. So see, I have this sales region by sales for west, center, east, and all the four regions. Okay, now let's create 
stack bar chart. So for that, what I will I need to do? I will take another variable, which is let's say profit. And here also I will change profit. And after that, I can create another plot dot bar here. So I need to write plot dot bar and region. And here I'm looking, let's say profit. And now what I need to write, I'm looking profit. And after that, I need to write bottom. This is one of the properties. So I want to mention here what I'm looking in the bottom. Let's say I'm looking sales in the bottom. So I can write sales. Okay. And let's say now I can change the color blue. Now I can run this. So see, I have a stack bar chart here blue for the sales and red for the profit okay now suppose if you need to create a buy axis on more than two columns so right now i have you know in data set multiple four columns but here i'm showing only two so let me create two more one by one so let's take discount. Okay, so I will do the similar thing. I will pass discount here. Okay, now what will I do? Here I will type this bar plot dot bar and so now in my first I can pass let's say profit so I need and uh, here in the second let's say I'm passing discount and here let's say I'm passing sales okay so profit is fine if I'm passing profit here so I need to mention I'm looking bottom equals to profit okay so why i am doing this because sales has you know use number so i am looking uh, this on top so that's the reason so first i took profit and after that discount and in bottom i took profit now if i need to add two in the bottom profit and discount for the sales so what I need to do, I need to use another function numpy, another library. Import numpy as np. So if you are not aware of the numpy, so you can watch my this Python for data science series and you can uh, check out ninth video of this. So I have uh, basically discussed uh, about numpy here in uh, 9, 10, 11, 12 section. Okay. Now, what will I do here? I will use plot dot bar and uh, here I will use np dot add and I am looking profit and discount. So profit would be my first and discount. Would be so if you need more than one on by axis, so we need to use numpy library. So np dot add it will basically add the different axis data. And if you need only one, so we don't need to add, we don't need to use np. We can simply use water equals to this bar. Okay, now let me pass another color. So let's say I'm passing below for first and red for second and then let's say gray for green for third 
ओके लेट मी रन दिस सो सी आई हैव थ्री एक्सिस on uh, i can say three by axis on x axis i have region and on y axis i have sales profit and discount now let's say if i need to add one more quantity which i have already added in my data set so again i will take another variable quantity and here also i will use this quantity okay and now again i can mention quantity here because i want sales in last and profit discount is fine now i can so by sales here okay so region profit region discount region quantity region now i need to add one more axis here so what i will do this is my previous one np dot add discount from which i am getting profit and discount now i need quantity as well so i need to add one more np dot add so this could be like whole uh like i can say uh, y axis for this uh, sales i i will add np dot add another value and i can use comma here okay and my third one is quantity so this would be like this np dot add and after that this would be my the uh, this would be the above one which i was using np dot add profit and discount and then this is the another one quantity which i want to use here now let me run this i can choose let's say gray color okay so see now i have gray green red and uh we look so i have everything like region by sales and uh, quantity discount and profit so what i can do if you are not seeing uh green so i can pass green first okay after that blue and after that let's say red then green so now let me run this again so see we have gray and then red blue and green so likewise we can you know add uh other by x that will and we can make use of this np dot add function okay so i hope this video is helpful thank you everyone